Greetings, e-commerce enthusiasts. Today, let's deliver. Let's delve into the nitty gritty of adding products from the best AliExpress marketplace into your Shopify store. I'm Steven, and you're watching TechPress. Let's dive in. Researching the products into AliExpress before we add products, let's start a strategy. Now, research is key to find winning products into AliExpress. Navigate through AliExpress. Find products with good reviews and assets the potential. We are not just adding products, we are curating a winning lineup. So, if you wanted to see how we can get started to making a really great research, what you can do is to go directly here into AliExpress.com. I clicked into this search bar, and now as you can see, we have the sold by. We have the delivery options, the brands, the price, and the reviews. Let's focus and click into reviews. Now here it says priced. You can view this as a list, as a gallery, or whatever. I usually just focus into list, which is much more faster. And I wanted to focus now into sort by the best matched. So uh, what I wanted to do is to see what people are telling about a few products. So in this case, I don't want to focus into this one. And here I have to discover more. So I delete it and I do have all the recommendations and I can see that we have home appliances, uh, discover more. So make your research. Focus now into what you wanted to sell um, depending on what you're selling into your store. Now let's add products to Shopify. Now let's seamlessly integrate these chosen products into your Shopify store. Are you ready for the magic? Well, into the Shopify store administrator, do you want to be focused into the products and add the products and then import the details? Now, usually it's going to be a little hard to add, like copy and paste all the information of a product you wanted to sell directly into your store. For example, let's say uh, this wireless Bluetooth uh, controller. I just copy all this info and I paste it into Shopify. So we are not going to do that. We're going to do this a little bit much more faster. Let's go ahead into applications. Let's go into all the recommended applications and go directly into the Shopify App Store. What we wanted to do is to get started and look out for a supplier that actually works with AliExpress. In this case, we want to try with Deezus. If you wanted to try with something else, that's really fine, but in our case, in this tutorial, let's focus into Deezus. So, you choose the Deezus application, you choose whatever application you wanted to, I hit into install, and then later on, I just grant the access from Shopify into Deezus. So, as you can see, we are now inside Deezus. What does this application do? Well, what this application does is to find products into AliExpress and automatically took all the information about this product and import it directly into your store. What you usually need to do is to edit the price, the title, the description, uh, even you can just leave it like that if you wanted to. So, uh, what I wanted to do is to look in and authorize. So, Log into your Deezer's account. If you don't have a Deezer's account, what you just need to do is to create an account. Really, really easy just to provide uh, an actual email, a passcode, and verify all of this information, and then you're good to go. So now that you're here into Deezer's, just click into the Find Suppliers. Here into Find Suppliers, what you wanted to do is to choose AliExpress. You can add another platform if you wanted to, but in my case, just focus into AliExpress. Now, what you wanted to do is to look out for the same product that you found directly into AliExpress. What you can do is to type the gamepad name, copy it, and paste it directly here into Deezus. Or what you can do is to paste the URL from AliExpress so it's going to be founded automatically. In my case, I just found it. Now, what I want to do is to look out for this product, but I wanted to check out what, how many orders have been made so far. And I really want great reviews, I really want to have really strong good comments so I can sell this product. Say that I like this product, hit into import it to your list. If you wanted to look out for more, hit into stay and add in. If you're okay with it, let's go for check. 
Now here you can see the imported list of all the products we wanted to add. So what I wanted to do is to hit and to edit the products before I send them. And here what I wanted to do is to change the actual title. You can change the collection where it's going to be appearing here. Uh, digital goods, for example, type, the tags, the vendor, and then later on you can change the variance. Now here into the variance, usually what we do is to change the actual price. The price of this product is cost uh, $20. The price is $20 with 36. So if you wanted to earn a little bit more uh, into this product, I can totally suggest you to make this a little bit much more higher than that. Let's say for example, $25 or 22, whatever. Then the description, the images, I should label like that and hit now into saved. After that, you can choose your product and push this directly into your store. Store selection. Now, if you don't know what's the name of your store, you can go back. And here you can see they have the store AF9, which is this one. I choose only this one and then I enable this one and push to the stores. And there we go. Automatically, your product is going to be pushed from AliExpress into your custom website. So adding products is just the first step. Let's make this listing irresistible with optimized description and eye-catching images. So usually what you just need to do is just leave it like that, but if you wanted to edit more stuff, you can always go into your products, make sure that your product has now been imported. If you don't see this, then later on you can just uh, reload the page, wait a few minutes, and then you're good to go. In my case, I do see it in here. So. Uh, the title looks great for me, the description looks great for me, the media looks great for me, so I believe that it's more than enough. In the search engine listing, I wanted to make people want actually wanted to buy this product. So Nintendo Switch Pro Controller, small, whatever. So it's a really great tool. The meta description, I want to make this smaller. This will be helping me to, uh, let's say, get more researched inside uh, Google. Lastly, let's manage the inventory and the fulfillment. We're almost there. Let's ensure the smoothing sailing by managing inventory and setting up the fulfillment. Keep tracking of your inventory, set stock alerts, and streamline fulfillments. Integrating AliExpress as a fulfillment option ensures a steam, uh, seamless order process. If I go back here, you can see that here into this product, I do have an inventory of 597 and stock for three different variants. When somebody makes an order in here, automatically the order should be sent directly into my DSS account here into open orders so what I just needed to do is to place the order into Aliexpress so they're gonna be making the order automatically for us so we don't have to do absolutely anything in other words we are doing drop shipping with Aliexpress Congratulations, you have successfully added products from AliExpress into your Shopify store. If you don't want to do dropshipping, maybe what you wanted to do is to do this manually. I mean, copy and paste all this information uh, into your store, and then later on, when somebody makes a purchase, you need to make the purchase uh, manually and then send it uh, to the shipment uh, stuff that the buyer just tell you. But I believe it's much more faster the way that I just uh, taught you guys. So, if you find this guide helpful, don't forget to give us a thumbs up, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more e-commerce steps into TechPress, guys. Thank you so much for joining me. Now go ahead and reach your Shopify store with excitement AliExpress products and start your journey to the e-commerce success. Until the next time, happy selling.